This is ridiculous. We've been stuck here for hours and we still don't know anything. And that detective's been interviewing Andrew for ages. It's with you, miserable bud. You'd think someone died. Do you not have a conscience? Show some respect. Sam's dead. Yeah, I know. I told him Paul did it. Why didn't you tell the detective you were sleeping with him? Because I wasn't. That was just a rumour. Everybody knows Paul. It wasn't much of a secret. We saw the emails you sent to her, Paul. We know you were fucking her. Well, that's bullshit. Her. I don't need to listen to any more of this nonsense. There was one email I found particularly tasty. It went something like, when I'm inside you, I feel complete and utter bliss. The inside of your thigh That's tastes enough. like... Cut it out. Fuck you, Paul. You're the only one here who has a motive to kill Sam. Do you honestly think I'd jeopardise the success of my business by murdering one of my own employees in their office? Yeah, I think you would. Maybe Andrew's right. You do have a motive, Paul. And Sam was killed in the office. It's bound to be someone who worked here. And Edith's got a motive too. I overheard her saying how she could kill Sam for getting the promotion over her. Scarlet, I was joking. Please. You were always calling her a bitch and a slut behind her back. Because she was a bitch. And she did slut her way up the corporate ladder. But it doesn't mean I killed her. Stop talking about her like that. If you want to start pointing the finger, start with Andrew. He's the most fucked up one of us all. I have no reason to kill Sam. She didn't bother me. Maybe no one killed her. Could have been an accident. Or maybe you killed her. It's always the quiet ones. And where were you, Tom? I'll leave him out of it, Andrew. I saw the way you reacted when she dumped you, Paul. You were furious. Shut up, Anita. You're just as vindictive as Andrew. And you hated Sam more than anyone, Anita. Because she didn't deserve the promotion. She earned that promotion fair and square. Yeah, she only earned it because she was fucking you. I'd you honestly think I'd promote someone with your attitude? She used you, Paul, and you couldn't handle it, so you killed her. Fuck you, Andrew. Consider you yourself fired. Say hello to the door. Go on, go on. Fucking hell, you're the worst. You're the worst. You're the worst. You're the worst. Oh, no. Excuse me! Can I have your attention, please? I thought you all might like to know that Samantha appears to have suffered from anaphylactic shock caused by an allergic reaction to peanuts. It seems that she was unable to find her EpiPen amongst the contents of her office. This would have allowed her to administer a life-saving dose of epinephrine. Nothing more sinister than a peanut in this case. So I suggest you all go home and get some rest. If we require you for further assistance, we'll be in touch. Scarlet, I just want to apologise for before. I didn't mean to be so blunt. I know you and Sam were really close. Don't worry about it. Anyway, I've got to get the KPI reports for Paul. I'll see you on Monday. KPI reports? God. Last thing on my mind. Can't wait to get home to bed. Night! Paul? I just thought I'd call to see if you're okay.